Hey gang, AV here. Just got a package from CGC. It is uh, just a small one, two books. Um, these, if I remember correctly, were a uh, um, a reholder service that I had done. Should be uh, two comics in here, which I just had to get new holders for. Uh, and I'll explain why as I get the book, when I get the books out. Jeez, I can't cut in here. Cut that shit. People are waiting. Let's go. This took uh, a little while to get back. Oh, I won't lie. Not that long, but not as long as some of my other orders. But longer than I thought it should have. So, anyhow. Open it up. Got some bubble wrap. Yeah, that looks like it should be it the only two book order I have with them so all right let's get this out of here huh, they didn't even rubber band the uh the thing on there all right is this the back that is the back all right so first order business that's the grade on that side yep all right first order business We've got Captain America, number 101, first appearance of the sleeper. And this is a 7.0. Uh, I got this reholdered because this was, I bought this already graded and it was in the uh, the, the old first, uh, first release cases with the tiny numbers in the middle and, and all that. And uh, I wanted to show off it's great, so. It's a lot easier to show off the grade when it's a big number. <laughs> so, very cool. I'm glad I didn't lose any uh, any uh, grade points when it was being graded. That's nice. All right, and next up we have the second book, uh, second and last book that I have. World War Hulk, number one. This is the Aspen Comics variant. Um, Michael Turner did this one. And he also signed it. This is a yellow label. I had to have this redone because um, I had actually was trying to sell this at an outdoor event. And uh, I had it laying on the table and the sun beat down and actually melted the inner well a little bit like you could actually see it had uh had warped the uh the label and just the top edge of the book here was warped inside the hard plastic because like the hard plastic worked like a magnifying glass and just amplified the sunlight in that one little area and melted the the inner mylar well that the comic book actually rests in so i had to send this in to get regraded and it's a nine eight and i'm very very happy that the uh that sun did not diminish the grade at all. Like, like I'm very happy that the uh, the uh, plastic did not melt to the book, you know. But I'm damn glad that I got this re-slabbed because now I can sell this in co with confidence. So, again, this is the late great Michael Turner had signed this right there in silver, which is looks pretty sharp on the cover, and the cover itself is pretty awesome. Very glad to have this back, and I will have this for sale on my uh, shortbox page. And, and uh, if you're not familiar with that, I actually have the puppy dog. Give me a second. All right, calm down. <laughs> if you're not familiar with that, I ha I'll have the link down in the video description so you can click on there and see what the books I have available for sale. And as I'm filming this, I actually have a comic book auction going on right now on Facebook. Uh, it's a reply auction in the comic book group called Comic Book Group. <laughs> so um, I'll actually put a link for that as well in the video description for this video. So if you're interested in any dollar books, feel free to check it out. As always, this has been AV. Thank you for watching my videos. Um, if you like this one, check out my channel. If you like what you see there, then please subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.